The holidays are here once again, and I gotta ask you, have you been naughty or have you been nice this year? Hey everyone, welcome to the candy aisle. My name is Jeff, and today we are looking at the naughty or nice holiday-themed Tic Tacs. Very exciting. This is the naughty variety. So since 2021, Tic Tac have come out with these, like a double skew, kind of fun, playful holiday theming on their uh, on their Tic Tacs. They've got uh, two flavors that are seasonal, um, a naughty and a nice variety. So in 2021-2022, the, the flavors were um, candy cane for the nice flavor, which is essentially peppermint, right? Let's not kid ourselves. And then uh, the naughty flavor was cinnamon. And I reviewed, I've reviewed both candy cane Tic Tacs and the cinnamon naughty version of Tic Tacs. But this year, 2023 is when I'm recording this, they uh, revised it. So the naughty version is now a sour cherry. Sour cherry right there, yeah. Lumps of coal, and it's designed to look, it's still like a Tic Tac shape, I think, but they're lumps of coal officially. Um, this is, a, I'm in Canada, so this is the, you know, the Canadian, it's got packaging with the, what do you call it, French on it. But I thought this was so cute. Um, and I hear tell, I just saw online, I don't know if it's accurate or not, someone on Reddit was talking about these are like selling out everywhere. Maybe, maybe, but uh, I thought I should review them just because I think a sour cherry is actually maybe a better fit even for Tic Tacs. Um, I, I feel like the cinnamon is fine, but you know, is that, is that, is that what you want? This packaging is a little mucked up. That's okay. It's like they didn't like label, <laughs> apply the label accurately. This, uh, it's like creased and stuff. Anyway, it's pretty cute. I like that these little, um, I guess these are Tic Tacs, aren't they? I was like, they're little jelly beans. No, they're obviously Tic Tacs. And then on the nice package where he's giving the candy, it's still candy cane. The nice package is one giving a candy cane to another one and they're very happy about it. This guy's not having it. Like, why did you give me coal? I'm giving you cherries. Anyway, I hope everyone's having a good holiday, whether you uh, celebrate Christmas or, uh, you know, something else. That's uh, it's all good by me. Um, what we're here to celebrate is candy and our love for candy. So uh, let's uh, let's break into these Tic Tacs. I've reviewed a bunch of Tic Tacs on this channel before. That's really what I do here on this channel. If you are not familiar, review candy. So if you are interested in that, come on and join the fun. Um, I don't review mints that often. There aren't that many mints. These are weird. These are so weird looking, right? So nice golden light here, but uh, what the what? They're like, they're like an odd, is it just the camera? Like, they don't look like black to me. Maybe they are. They look kind of off. They're not as, they're not that, uh, what's that, you know, that black, that absor paint, black paint you can get that absorbs all light or 99% of light. That's what I was hoping for. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, let's, uh, let's give these a try. Sour cherry. I can't remember ever having a sour cherry Tic Tac, but sour cherry's a good idea for a Tic Tac, I would say. Mm. Oh yeah. Oh, that's so weird. <laughs> oh, Typical Tic Tac on the inside, right? Just a mint. But boy, that sour cherry flavor pops. Mm. A little bit of the paint wearing off onto my hands. That sour cherry flavor is really strong and crazy. I don't know why, like I've had sour cherry flavor before. I think I was thinking of like, maybe a little more like a wild cherry flavor, but these taste like, <laughs> these taste just like a sour cherry candy, like a sour cherry ball. You know, do you know what I'm talking about? I reviewed sour cherries on the channel before, a long time ago. They are great, not like, Oddly, not like a super popular. Maybe they don't have a great shelf life. This tastes just like that. Like the flavor is exactly like a sour cherry, like a sour cherry ball. You know what I mean? Um, this isn't like a black cherry, but it's so weird because it's the texture and you know the crunch and everything is just like a standard Tic Tac. 
I didn't even think of that. I don't know why. I think I was just thinking of like a regular cherry, but this is um very good. What a nice surprise. You know, I haven't had sour cherries in at least since last summer, probably longer though. They're um they're great candy. You just don't see them everywhere. They're not like bagged on the normal on the shelves normally. I don't think. Or not in the like standard candy aisle, maybe the grocery store or something, or like a bulk store or something. I don't know. You you know what I mean? They're not like at the checkout, that's for sure. But this is uh this is a very good flavor. It's got that same, like, you know, obviously the classic Tic Tac sort of crunch. Um, I get why they didn't change the shape, but that's the only thing I might have said. If they had actually made it little lumps of coal, like little, whatever those are, other hexagons or something like that. That might have been kind of cool. But, you know, manufacturing and... One, one, manufacturing, but two, this is the brand, right? Is it a Tic Tac if you change the shape? I, I don't know. Maybe not. I think they did a great job with this. This is uh, definitely one to look out for. I really recommend this, absolutely. This may be one of my favorite Tic Tacs that I've had. And it's a shame, because it's gonna be um, limited time, right? So I guess go get it while you can. Um, as I'm recording this, it is like basically Christmas. So, you know, get these, get these while they're on the shelf now. And hopefully next year they'll come back again with another naughty and nice skew and it will once again be the sour cherry because um, these are fantastic. I'm going to rate this Tic Tac naughty uh, sour cherry. I'm going to rate them a full five out of five. Yeah, they're that good. But uh, that's that, that's my take. What do you think? Let me know down in the comments below. Um, thanks very much for watching. I hope everyone, uh, whether you celebrate Christmas or whatever you're celebrating, you are having a wonderful holiday, and I hope you are taking time for yourself and to, like, you know, be uh, be okay. Just I hope everyone's okay out there. That's all. Uh, as for me, I will be back with, uh, you know, more reviews next week. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. Have a, uh, have a great, uh, great day, and I will see you next time. So long, everyone. Bye-bye.